Hello everyone, welcome back to Barter Times and welcome back to this channel. You know, this Gavi injury happened about two days ago, but I was just trying to get all the details and be confirmed about this Gavi ACL injury issue. So Fabrizio too have come out to confirm everything that Gavi has torn his ACL. His season is over, is completely over with Barcelona. He will be out for six to eight months you know when this happened to Gavi on the pitch in the game against Spain and Georgia Gavi was crying like a baby yes he was crying like a baby in the dressing room you know aside Gavi going to stay at home for a long time this thing right here is very very painful yes of course all footballers around the world never want to experience this kind of injury and it seems some of you don't understand the ACL very well so here is the meaning of that ACL the anterior cruciate illegitimate in the knee so this is a tissue that connect the thigh bone so as you can see here the thigh bone to the shine bone at the knee yes so this this um, tissue right here you see is what Gavi has torn his own and for you to recover from this kind of injury it will take you six to eight months of course here I will blame the Spanish school De La Fonte because he said Gavi is the one who came out to say he want to play so that he can break Ramos record and all of kind of things. You, you just have to know Gavi is just 16, um, 19 years old. So sometimes you have some little bit of um, joy to enjoy himself a lot. But you as a coach, you need to know he's just a young boy, his mind can tell me what to do. But you need to take some, um, um, let me see, some some command you understand if you say you can we, we want to bend gavi i don't think the player can force himself like no no matter what i want to be in the lineup that's why you are a coach you have to take decision you have to make decision you never allow 19 year old boy to make decision for you that i want to play so let me be in the lineup you know what gavi have played and the one that pains me a lot is spain have already qualified you understand and that is why Barca are very very angry with the Fonte. Spain have already qualified, so why do we have to play Gavi in that match, in that meaningless match against Georgia? You understand? It's very painful. So as you can see Gavi here, the time he was leaving Spain to, he, he was leaving the camp to Barcelona. He, he was walking with crutches and you can see Gavi face here, the time he was leaving on the page, he was crying like a baby. For sure, this thing is very, very painful. And as I said, all footballers around the world never want to experience this kind of injury. It's very, very painful. For sure, it's very painful. We wish Gavi speed recovery, of course. I know this guy will come back stronger. And one dangerous thing about this injury is that when it's happening to you, you can lose your form. You understand? The form that you were in can never return again. But at different side too he can also return but we wish Gavi spring recovery and we know his form will come back stronger than ever and that is all for today guys i don't know how to see I, i'll see you guys soon in the next one but i thank you guys for your support and also for watching this video we all wish the best recovery for Gavi since he's going to be out for six to eight months we know he will recover as soon as possible and we are going to see him one day um, um in Barcelona again i think this time gavi will return while barca will be moving to the camp room and that will be a special day for gavi gavrina i will see you guys in the next one but until then vishka barca vishka catalonia thank you guys for your support and also for watching this video thank you